in this video lecture i am going to evaluate limit x tend to a sin x minus sin a divided by root x minus root a so let's see the answer so first you are writing the given limit x tend to a after that here sin x minus sin a divided by root under x minus root a so we can easily achieve the output if i use this formula sin x minus sin y the formula is 2 cos x plus y divided by 2 into sin x minus y divided by 2 so here let's write limit x tend to a and here so sin x minus sin a we can write 2 cos x plus a divided by 2 into sin x minus a divided by 2 and here root x minus root a now here you can see root x minus root a so we need to sorry x minus a so we need to make that this one root x minus root a for this uh, multiplying here root x plus root a with numerator and denominator after that doing this here you can see suppose this is a a b b plus minus a minus b a plus b between multiplication is there so a minus b that is a square minus b square so writing here limit x tend to a so writing 2 cos x plus a divided by 2 into sin x minus a divided by 2 so this here a square root x square that is so x and root a square that is a and now we need to make that 2 so for this we can mul we should multiply here 2 now this term is the same okay and uh, thereafter the next is multiplication root x plus root a so here this term that return 1 okay so this term return because uh, here x minus a divided by 2 x minus a divided by 2 so now this 2 2 cancel so this term return 1 and here cos x that is a plus a divided by 2 this term return 1 and here this here root x so x plus a this is not in the addition this is on the multiplication so this return 1 this and here after root x that is a and a after that this here cos a plus uh, cos 2a that become a plus a 2 2 to cancel here after this is here multiplication this return root 2 root a now our final answer is 2 root a cos a this is our final answer of this uh, integration question so one time going to repeat right here sin x minus sin y that is 2 cos x plus y by 2 and here x minus y divided by 2 so use this formula now you can get here root x is there so x minus a is there so we need to make that same so numerator and denominator multiply with root x plus a root x plus root a and this is the form of a plus b a minus b root x square that is x root to b a square that is a and here we need to or oh, this is 2 here so we need to divide with 2 so here multiplying 2 now this 2 this, this 2 cancel this return 1 and here put x plus a so a plus a divide by 2 into 1 here x plus a root a plus root a here that is 2a divide by 2 into 2 root a that return to root a cos a so this is the way we can evaluate this limit question so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you